the way you say it. Um, she says, when I pray Salah, am I allowed to close my eyes, especially when I recite Surah Al-Fatiha? This is, she says, so that she can concentrate on the meanings of the verses. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Alhamdulillah wa salatu wa salam ala nabiyihi wa mustafa. Sayyidin Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa minu alaah. All praise due to Allah. We praise him and we seek his help. Whomsoever Allah guides is the truly guided one and whomsoever Allah leaves astray, no one can show him guidance. May the best peace and blessings be upon Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Closing the eyes during the salah, whether reciting Surah Al-Fatiha or in any other rukn such as ruku or sujood is disliked, makro. Unless if one cannot attain khushu'a and tranquility in the salah, uh, except with closing the eyes. In this condition, Ibn al-Qayyim, may Allah have mercy on him, says in his beautiful book, Zad al-Ma'ad, with mm. regards to this mas'ala, uh, whatever is convenient for the person to attain khushu'a in the salah is permissible. So sometimes closing the eyes in this condition will be uh, not just permissible, recommended. If one cannot obtain khushu'a and tranquility in the salah, unless he or she closes their eyes. Uh, we should also understand that the sunnah is to look at the spot of your sujood. That's uh, most likely to make you obtain khushu'a. Sometimes also closing the eyes will be recommended if you are facing in many masajid nowadays, and by the way, this is one of the signs of the their judgment, where the masajid are being decorated, and the prayer rugs and Jalal namaz mm-hmm. are fully decorated, uh, distracting the attention of the musalli. So if this is the case, he or she are closing their eyes in, all, in order not to distract their attention by whatever they are looking at, that too is permissible, and Allah is best. Jazakallah khashan.